Hey guys, they will meet you one more time. A very warm welcome and a very good evening to all of you. Hope you guys are doing well, right? So guys, in my previous sessions, I have talked about so many things. I have tried to provide you the best knowledge about life, about career. How you can write down one professionalism. What are the things you need to say in an HR interview? How you can prove yourself in an organization? So I have tried to provide you the best knowledge as per my knowledge. So in my today's session, I am I'm, I'm going to talk about something that is very interesting as well as crucial also. If you are going to give an interview, what kind of questions can be asked in an interview? Uh, you need to know about that. So I, I am trying to solve uh, the first question, the most important first top 10 questions, questions that can be asked in an interview. So let's get started. So at first, are you ready to ask your upcoming job interview? One of the most important part of interview preparation is being ready to respond effectively, right? To the questions that employers typically ask. So since these interviews questions are so common, hiring managers will ex expect you to be able to answer them smoothly and without any hesitation, guys. So here are the top 10 interview questions employees are likely to ask, okay? So I'm trying to provide you the answers. The questions are like that, okay? So tell me about yourself. This is one of the first question you are likely to be asked. Be prepared to talk about yourself and why you are an ideal candidate for this position. The interviewer wants to know why you are an excellent fit for this job role. Okay. Try to answer these questions about yourself without giving too much or too little personal information. You can start by sharing some of your personal interests and experiences that don't relate directly to work, such as a fa your favorite hobby or a brief account of where you grew up, your education and what motivates you, okay? The second question can be, why are you the best person for this job? Are you the best candidate for the job? The hiring manager wants to know whether you have all the required qualifications. Be prepared to explain why you are the applicant who should be hired. Okay. Make your response a confident, concise, focused and always why you should get this job. Try to explain that. This is a good time to review the qualifications and the requirements in the job listing. Okay. So you can craft a response that aligns with what the interviewer is looking for. So the, the possible third question, why do you want this job? So this is very crucial question, guys. Why are you a good fit for this position? Why would you accomplish if you were uh, hired? What would you, would you accomplish if you hired? Okay, these interview questions gives you an opportunity to show the interviewer what you know about the job and about the company. So take time and beforehand to thoroughly research the company its product services culture and mission okay be specific about what makes you a good fit for this role and mention aspects of the company and position that appeal to the most okay so the fourth possible question how has your experience prepared you for this role hiring managers use this question to learn how your previous work experience and educational background fit for the job to prepare to respond make a list of the most relevant qualifications you have and match them to the requirement listed in the job description it is important to explain how your experience will help the employer if you are to be hired you can use the uh, most important information to prepare uh, the examples to share with the interviewer so you don't need to memorize your answers, but do the uh, do ready to uh, share what you accomplished in your previous roles. Okay, so why are you leaving or you have left your previous job? So be prepared with a response to this question. You will need to give an answer that is honest and reflects your specific circumstances that keep it positive. Even if you quit under challenging circumstances, now isn't the best time to share what could be constructed or as too much information with the interviewer, okay? So the interviewer wants to know why you left your job and why you want to work for their company. When asked about why you are moving on, 
from your current position stick with the facts be direct and focus your answer on the future especially if you are uh, your departure wasn't under the best circumstances okay so what is your greatest strength this is one of the questions that employers almost always ask to determine how will how well you are qualified for the position when you are asked about your greatest strength it's important to discuss the attributes that qualify you for the specific job and that will set you apart from other candidates when you are answering the question remember to show rather than tell for example rather than stating that you are an excellent problem solver instead tell a story that demonstrate this ideally drawing on and the any code from your professional experiences okay what is your greatest weakness answer typical questions that interviewers will ask is about your weaknesses do your best to frame your answer around positive aspects of your skills and abilities as an employee turning seeming weaknesses into strengths this question is an opportunity to show the hiring manager that you are well qualified for the job in addition to learning whether you are you have got the right credentials the hiring manager wants to know whether you can take on challenges and learn new tasks okay the next question is how do you handle stress and pressure what do you do when things don't get smoothly at work okay how do you deal with difficult situations the employer wants to know how you handle workplace stress do you work well in high stress situations do you thrive on pressure or would you prefer a more low key job what do you do when something goes wrong okay avoid claiming that you never or rarely experience stress rather formulate your answer in a way that acknowledges was based stress and explains how you have overcome it or even used it to your advantage what are your salary expectations what are you looking for in terms of salary questions about money are always tricky to answer you don't want to sell yourself short or price yourself out of a job offer okay in some locations employers are legally prohibited from asking you about salary history but they can ask how much you expect to get paid so do your research before the meeting so that you will be prepared to name a salary if you are asked okay there are several free online salary calculators that can provide you with a reasonable range of based on your skill title employer experience skills and location so last but not the least the question is what are the goals for the future are you a job hopper or do you plan on staying with the company at least for a while where do you you envision your career going do you your plans for the future match the career path for someone typically hired for this position this question is designed to find out if you are going to stick around or move on as soon as you find a better opportunity keep your answer focused on the job and the company and try to give the answer to the interviewer that the position aligns with your long term goals okay so guys these are the top 10 questions that can be asked by an interviewer during the interview i will try to provide you more possible answers in my another session okay so this is for today's session and if you find my videos are helpful kindly subscribe my channel hit the bell icon and comment and do share it with your family friends and other people also and in pcs global we provide training in java full stack we provide training in salesforce we provide training in java devops and data science python uh, machine learning as ai as well so if you are a candidate who wanted to start your career through pcs global we are always here to help you we helped more than 1500 plus candidates we are helping more than 1400 plus candidates who was working with us right now and right now in pcs global global our work in sessions are going on you can join our work in session or in our several centers right now pcs global is located in several locations also the first one is uh, is in kolkata then bengaluru then 
Bhubaneswar. If you wanted to visit kindly, call in the numbers. Our concerned persons will be there. Communicate with them and try to visit our centers and try to attend our walk-in session. And after having that walk-in session, you will get to work. You will get the opportunity to work with us and you will get the uh, after completion of your internship with us, you will get the certification from our side as uh, with the associate code and you will get the opportunity to work in your, your precise job role. So kindly guys, don't waste time. Visit our centers, get the best from our side, make your future better and try to prove yourself in this today's job scenario. We all know that there is a huge gap in IT companies. There is vacancies, but they don't get the proper skill candidates. So we are trying to give you that opportunity to start your career in IT. So this is your duty to communicate with us in it, and it's our responsibility to help you. Kindly communicate and get the best. So this is for now, guys. Bye for now.